Hello Troopers, welcome back to Star Wars Knights of the Old Republic. We are going to be going to, this is part 30, 73, I believe? Yeah. We're doing the Geno Harridan mission, which is my favorite, because it's like, it involves all the planets, because most of the missions in this game, you know, they only revolve around one planet, like, oh, go to this part of the map, oh, go to this part of the map. But here, like, you're like an intergalactic assassin. It's freaking cool. Um, but anyways, we're about to go to Kashyyyk to kill our final guy to get initiated into the Geno Harridan clan whatnot so I will pick up then when we're in Kashyyyk and we're back here troopers with uh Candrus and Karth but let me just equip my weapons here let's see here do you know Herodin poison blade holy crap 5 to 15 I'll take it and let's see how 4 to 14 12 2 to 12 5 another good lord Five to, two five to fifteens. Oh man. Look at that. We're just gonna rip through people. It's okay. We're fine. Maybe I should just have one sword. I don't think it matters. Last time we were here, we helped a freaking, you know, Wookiee riot revolution. Saved all the slaves. Anyways, uh, I'm just going to pick up back when we're in the Underland because that's where we're hunting this guy. So I will be right back as soon as this loading screen ends. This guy, this guy, what the heck? I'm just walking down the pathway and I find this guy, this is the guy that gave me that data pad for the Geno Herodin, Cine Vec. He's also got the last name of that other. Do you, do you, do you pretend... Perchance know who Vec is, Mr. Cine Vec, if that is even your real name? What are you even doing? Aw, look at this guy. He's so loyal. <laughs> okay, there is some aliens to kill in this, I believe, still. The, the freaking Kinrath, whatever they're called. But anyways, I'll be right back, guys. And we're here, troopers. So I don't know where he's supposed to be at. I know he's a shapeshifter, that's all we know. So you two better be keeping your eyes out. Anything suspicious down in the underlands where all the demons lurk. That's what I always like to say. <clears throat> so there's the corpse. Somebody I don't really even know. Um, we're just going to go right, you know? Right is the right path. That's what I always say at least. And doesn't that can't, the two rights cancel out and make it a path of evil? Maybe. But we're going to take that chance. Usually you go left all the time. Clockwise, that's always good. We're just gonna fill out the eastern side. Nope, he's not over there. I know he's under a walkway of some sort. Could he be down this path? No, I doubt it. I highly, highly doubt it. Yep, not down that path. You know, as a young kid, like, there are a lot of parts of this game that are just kind of scary, like, playing this game as a little kid before, like, the graphics of today, like, it was crazy. Here, there he is. Is that him? Yeah, because he's dead, isn't he? I don't know. Yep, it's him. Let's do this, troopers. Why do you disturb me? Comes the Shadowlands to get away from your kind. I want some questions. I'm no slave. Leave me be. Okay, that's not him. Never mind. I wait. You are. Oh, I have to. Dang it! I forgot. I have to search this corpse to get the data pad that proves. How do I prove? Oh yes, we'll keep corpse. That data pad right there. Got to read it. And it will tell us exactly what to do. Oh my goodness, the mass sensitivity of this crap. Okay. Um, the final entry is a particular so We were fools to come down here, all of us. How can we hope to capture an enemy that can assume any shape, any form? We last two the first day, another three disappeared the day after that. Our enemies blood less no slow limit. We found Kovrara's body last night. What was left of it? We do not leave the chance to become victims of the faceless one. See, that's like so creepy. The faceless one. It's like freaking Slender Man, Star Wars style. Holy crap. Mm. Why do you disturb me? According to this data pad, you're dead. Mm. So you've uncovered my little secret. 
This body is grown tiresome to me. Maybe I can find another to your liking. A torrent attack? No. Got something on your mind, dude? What the touch impossible? Your tricks don't fool me, Rulon. You gonna die. You guys just gonna stay in there or uh what? Yep, there you go, that's good. Oh! Oh god! You asked for this! What? Um why are they those Okay, there we go. Attack! Attack! Let's go! Oh no! They killed Revan! What the hell? Ready? Yes? So he turned into... A, uh, a what? One of the attack? Where... Where can he run to then? I forgot, you have to like just randomly attack Attack tax! Attack attack! It's like whack a mole. Attack attack. But also the name of a band. Two bands, actually. Hmm. I can't remember where he went. only gone to a few places, honestly. Ah, yes, here we go. He's one of these tacks. Attack it. Death. Is that it? Oh my gosh. First try. Hell yeah. Isn't this supposed to be like a a freaking data pad? No. Um. Oh, this is a journal about the three Sith that attacked the Tourette attack. We got this. Data pad was covered from the remains of the Torrent attack on Kashyyyk and must have been devoured by the beast. It appears to be the personal drawing of what his, hell his name is. The last entry explains what he's doing with Kashyyyk. Duran and Shada, uh, I think I've read this, Shalia have given in to their passion for each other and are doomed to fall to the dark side. I tried to warn them, but they called me arrogant and accused me of being the one on the dark path that left the fools on Korriban. But I'm not about to abandon my mandate to give me by the Jedi Council. I will destroy the Torrent attack wherever I find them. Yet, <laughs> he, uh, <laughs> he died. Anyway, so. Oh. There wasn't a data pad for us? Well, I thought it was like something like overseers are dying or something like that. I don't know. But anyways, let's, uh, get back. I will pick up back on the Ebon Hall. We are back, guys. And we're back. Oh, gosh. I forgot to equip that Gino Harridan thingamajig. Where is it? You know, I in stealth unit. Stealth plus eight. Good lord. Just putting none right there. There we go. All right, so I'm gonna go back to Manon. I'll be right back, guys. All right. Oh God. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> We're here. Here we go. Who lost? Hello. Welcome back. I see you've come alone. This is good. I assume you're here to discuss the business of the Juno Herod and Rudon Pulak. Prolik. Pro Prolik is dead. I must congratulate you. Rudon is no easy target. I will admit that you are not the first to be sent after him, though you are the only one to succeed. Here, take the Juno Herod advisor is to increase their sense and improve their skills. Really is quite an extraordinary item. Born Rudon Itharak. That is all of them. You've done it, DX Wings. I hardly dreamed it was possible. Yet now the task is done. All the years of planning, spying, and digging to discover their true identities was all worth it. Now that you inherited our mind alone, you bastard. So apparently, he was one of the overseers, and so were the other three, and I just killed the overseers for him. So now he owns the Geno Herodin. I would have 
expected him to take me someplace, told me, and then tried to kill me instead of just telling me right in the middle of the street. What are you talking about? You Poor foolish Dan Twiggins. You have no idea that the targets I sent you after were the three of the overseers that you inherited. The overseers have always acted in secret. Their true identity is hidden from the guild and even each other to prevent one person from seizing control. But now they are dead and I am the only overseer left in the guild. All the agents of the Gina Herodin are mine to command and I haven't, couldn't have done it without your help, DX Wiggins. So then can I get in the guild? I'm sorry, even after all you've done for that, I cannot let you join the Gina Herodin now. You are far too dangerous. You know the true identity of the only surviving overseer. I suppose I could try to have you eliminated, but I've seen your skills dispatched in other overseers. I think it would be in both our best interests if we were simply to part ways. Nobody pays me for a fool. Plays me for a fool. You'll pay for this, who lost? I was afraid it would come to this very well. We will finish this as these things have always seemed. In bloodshed. But these streets of Narn are no place. Meet me in the Dune Sea. They will engage in ritual black battle according to the customs of my guild. Just you and me. Goodbye. Okay. <laughs> I'm not stupid. I know you're going to bring somebody with you. So I'll bring some people of mine. Anyways, guys, um, I guess that's it. We're going to conclude the Gino Heritage missions with the next episode, so stay tuned. Leave a like, bit if you enjoyed, and subscribe to become a trip today. I'll see you guys next time.